and welcome to English with Jodie. Today's story is Pete the Kitty's first day of preschool and it's by Kimberly and James Dean. The story is available on Amazon and in bookshops. Today is a big day for Pete the Kitty. It's going to be so cool. It's his first day of preschool. What should Pete bring to school today? He takes pencils, glue sticks, a paintbrush and crayons too. Of course, Pete's favourite colour is blue. He runs to put everything in his new backpack. Pete's backpack is really groovy. He picked it out himself at the store. Now it's time to head out the door. Don't forget your snack, Pete, says Mum. Pete thinks a banana will be an awesome snack. The school bus stops in front of Pete's house. Pete gets on the bus for the first time. He knows just what to do. His big brother Bob rides the bus too. Bob walks Pete to his classroom. Are you nervous? Bob asks. No, says Pete. I'm cool. See you after school. Pete meets his teacher. She wears glasses and has lots of style. Welcome to preschool, she says with a big smile. At story time, Pete's teacher reads a book about a mouse who loves cookies and a cat who loves his shoes. Pete loves cookies and his shoes too. Next, it is time to paint. Pete paints a blue kitty as happy as could be. Look, it's me. It's almost snack time. Let's wash our paws. Pete eats his banana. He eats every bite. Yum! That was just right. Now it's time to sing. Everyone gathers around to sing their favourite songs. Pete loves singing along. Soon it's time to go home. But Pete isn't ready to leave. He loves reading, painting, snacking and getting to sing. Preschool is awesome. Pete loves everything. The end. Would you like to see my backpack from my first day at school? Yeah. Here it is, can you see? It's blue and red and it's got the Paw Patrol on it. My favourite characters, Rubble, Chase and Marshall. Shall we see what's inside? Let's undo the zip and let's see. <gasps> we have some of the same things as Pete the Cat. Let's have a look. Mm. We've got our paintbrush, very important if we need to paint, and here some paint, which is the colour? Blue, that's right, so we've got our paintbrush and our blue paint. Do you remember? Blue was Pete the Cat's favourite colour. What's your favourite colour? Ah, I like pink. My favourite colour is pink, like my top. We've also got in here, because it's very important, because we're going to do a lot of colouring at school, some crayons. I've got here 
a black crayon, a green crayon, a brown crayon, a purple crayon, a blue crayon, and the last one is, that's right, a yellow crayon. So we've got our paint and our paintbrush and our crayons. We also do a lot of cutting and sticking at school, don't we? So we need some glue. Well done. So we put that down there as well. Mm, let's see. Two more things in the bag. Hmm. I think after doing our painting and our colouring and our sticking, I think we're going to feel very, very hungry, don't you? So it's really important that we have something to eat. We have our snack. And my snack is a banana. Mm, I love bananas. So let's put that yellow banana down there. And I've got one more thing. Are you ready? Yeah? The last thing in my bag, Pete the cat's teacher had these in the book. Let's see if you can remember what they were. What were Pete the cat's teacher wearing on her eyes? Do you remember? She had, she was very cool. She was wearing some glasses. Do I look very cool? Like Pete the cat's teacher? Yeah? Good, so glasses, they help me to see a little bit better. Sometimes I need them if I'm reading a book or doing some colouring. So these are glasses. So if you wear glasses, you're very cool as well. So let's put them back and look at all these things that we have in our backpack. Let's put them back and see if we can remember. A paintbrush and some blue paint some crayons, some glue, a banana and our very groovy glasses all in our backpack ready for school or maybe we can put the book and maybe the teacher will read it on the first day of school as well. So, thank you for listening to the story. It's been fantastic to share this book with you. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.